Hi, I'm John Carroll. I'm a faculty member in the Department of Geography and the Environment. I first became aware of Open Educational Resources, or OER, uh, from our campus's Affordable Learning Solutions campaign. It's been going on for several years, and I would hear about it and think, oh, wow, this is a great idea. I should uh, take a look at this. And so I would check out the materials, and I, I never found anything suitable for any of my classes. Uh, then I found out that a colleague of mine at another university had actually uh, written an OER textbook. Unfortunately, again, that was not for a class that I teach, but he enjoyed the experience. He loved how his students responded to it. Uh, and so I thought, I got to look a little bit deeper. And so uh, I've continued to check things out. One place that I found ex especially helpful was the Cool for Ed website, so coolfored.org. And I went there uh, and started looking at some of those resources. And uh, then I ultimately got connected to merlot.org. Uh, which I, was where I found a textbook that I ended up using in my Geography 481 Introduction to Geographic Information Systems class. Uh, GIS is uh, essentially computer mapping, and because it's a, a, a technology field, uh, it updates and, and advances very quickly, and so textbooks become stale. And so I've always been hesitant to uh, burden my students with the cost of a, of a very expensive textbook for a class where that textbook might be out of date uh, quickly. And so I was looking for something uh, online, something that might be updated. And uh, fortunately, through Merlot, I was able to find a textbook that I found was suitable. It's called GIS Commons. Turns out it's written by a, a colleague up at Sacramento State University here in the CSU system, so that I knew that this person w understood the audience uh, of classes that I was going to be teaching. And I've checked it out, and it works great. And so for the last couple semesters, I've assigned uh, the textbook to the students in that class. And they like it. I mean, they like having a, a textbook that's up to date. They like having a textbook that's free. Uh, that's the most important part for them. I also became aware of OER materials uh, when my own son went away to college. He was in a chemistry class that used the OpenStax chemistry book, uh, and it was phenomenal. I couldn't believe how good the book was, and more importantly, the fact that it was free. Uh, I, you know, I know as a parent now, as well as a faculty member, that uh, sticker shock is a real thing uh, for our students, and it's a big deal to keep those costs down. And so I'm going to be looking for OER materials for my other classes as well, because I think it's a great uh, opportunity for our students to get the learning materials they need at an affordable price. Thank you.